I've heard mixed comments about Helsinki so far. The gentleman at the hostel I was just saying that said it's fantastic. Uh, Finnish guy in Cyprus I met says it's boring. Uh, I beg to differ with the Cyprus man. I will find out when I have a bit of a wonder. Well, one thing the guy did say when I arrived in Helsinki is to watch out for the trams. Because apparently, they don't stop for anyone. <laughs> okay, it's my first snow shower. It's in the middle of the night, I know, but I saw it happening. I'm like, I have to go check it out. So, let us go for a wander. So cool. I don't even care. Oh, I want to get to daytime snow shower. That's my goals are daytime snow shower, reindeers and huskies, and northern lights. That'll be my goal achieved for the year. It just looks so fresh, and I'm surprised how quickly it builds up. Oh, so cool! Oh, so beautiful. It's not a big. Not a big flurry, but ah, it's giving me my snow fix. So we're up early this morning, finally for once. So I've got quite a few plans for things to check out today, so let us away. Cheating with the tram today. Get another decent, easy enough public transport to work with. Now this here is the, unfortunately, the Helsinki Christmas Market. That finished two days ago. So, that's a bit of a pain. But anyway, can't be helped. Let's see if I can make an ass of myself climbing up these stairs. Alrighty, let's go check it out. Let's go have a look inside. Look at the sun is shining on that one. What a sunrise. Merry Christmas for tomorrow. I commented on this before, except in reverse. I love how it feels like it could be 7.30 in the morning, but really it's past 10 o'clock. The, the low sunrise is really just... Un just loving the change of nature on me. Cool, so I'm gonna catch a <coughs> gonna catch a ferry up to one of the islands in about half an hour or so. But before that, I'm going to try and quickly check out one more cathedral uh, before before then. Uh, again, if I don't make it, I can always come back here. Oh. I'm definitely going to go for a uh, hot sauna thing in a couple of days, and I'll see if I do ice fish swimming. That there is like the ferry I'm going to take, so it's going to a island past on the way in called Suomalina. Uh, it's a fortress island, protected by harbour. There is the other ferry arriving. So the Celia Lines has two ferries, Symphony and Serenade. They basically just alternate between here and Stockholm. So one's in Stockholm, the other's in Helsinki. So Serenade would have taken the people to Stockholm yesterday. And then today they're coming back here. 
Whereas my mom would have head back to Stockholm. I think that we pretty much made it already. So it took about 15 minutes or so to get there in the end. And welcome to the small island of Sumolina. Alrighty, now we've got the whole island to explore for a little bit. It's us away. This island is the Naval Academy. So, I don't know, it's fairly open. I don't, I don't know how well we'll be able to get in, but anyway, this is so cool. It's like an island suburb, 15 minutes from the city of Helsinki itself. So the F island, which is this one I believe, is the residential area. So, don't need to go over here. And let's head back into the centre of the, get to the main island. There's fresh snow as well from last night. So the centre of the main island we've got a rather cute looking little church. Oh, I think I'm sorted for this weather. Let's get that sun out of the way. Oh. Ah, so you can just see that the uh, little barrier around this church is made up of old cannons and old sea chains. That's pretty cool. Looks like this is a old fortress island built in the 18th century, occupied by the Russians for a long time until the Finnish gained independence in 1918, I believe it was. Ooh. Ooh. And now it looks like we're heading to the fortress part of the island. So that should be Island B, I believe. It's so slightly smaller than the main island. Yeah, that's the one. Let's get going. is actually the tomb of the uh, man who built the fortress. He was part of the uh, Kingdom of Sweden, but Finland was part of Sweden. Until it became a Russian naval base in 1808. So what we've also got here is one of the oldest dry docks in uh, the Baltic region. So uh, this here has been building ships since the mid 18th century, so at 1754 I think it was. Of course they made Swedish ships, Russian ships, ferry ships. And now it looks like this. Quite a decent sized dry dock but it hasn't been filled up in a while by the looks of it. And I've reached the crossroads. Do I look warm enough? No, I don't know. It really could be warmer.
when people are stuck on the ice and all of a sudden crack. That's a chunky block. Ah, oh, this is cool. Alrighty then, do we want to fire over the cannons? Heading back in towards the island, uh, see if the church has opened up, and then if that's all good. Then maybe quick, quick shops to get some water, and then we'll make my way back to Helsinki. I don't know where the hell I found myself. It's a cave in the stalactites. Holy crap! We found the cave. And we'd like to see. But yeah, it's again, it's only a small one, but this is still pretty cool. The wild guess, since they have that tunnel I was just in, is an escape tunnel from the fortress. Now, just need to wait for the ferry to take me back to Helsinki. And then we'll be all done here. So, these are reindeer hot dogs. I feel bad, but I'm gonna do it. Ooh, this used to be a reindeer, and I'm still gonna eat it. Just tastes like a normal one. Alright, so we're off the ferry now. Gonna go have a look at this last cathedral here for the day, and then. Head into the market square, check it out, see if the Twisted Market's are is still on, and then finish up. So it's only open during... So it's not open from the 23rd to the 26th, and today's the 24th. Okay, well, that seems like a good enough run for Helsinki for the first day. Uh, Semolina... Oh, Suo Melina. They're definitely pronouncing that as some Italian flower, but anyway. Uh, it was beautiful, it was fantastic with the with all of the fortress and the snow. Ah, oh, I just love that sort of stuff. It's great. The cathedral with the sunrise was beautiful. Now tomorrow's Christmas. Do I have any special plans for Christmas? Nope. Just gonna be here.